I'm going to show you three different ways in which you can convert your Word documents to the PDF files. So let's see the first option. So let's say I have this cv.docx file. I'm going to open it with my Word app, which I have installed on my Windows operating system. And let's say I want to convert this uh, cv.docx file into the PDF file using this Word app. The process is really easy. You just need to click on the file option here and then you just need to click on save as and then click on browse option here. So just click on browse option and you can see the document name is cv.docx. Here under this uh, document name, you will see save as type. So just click on this drop down menu and you will be able to see this PDF option here. So just select PDF option here and then your file will be saved as PDF. Okay, so just select PDF and you can also choose uh, different options by clicking uh, this options button. Uh, for example, if you want to um, just save some of the pages of your documents, so you can uh, just uh, click on pages and then uh, you can provide the range also from here. And also you have uh, different other options. So you can just select the options you want and then click on save and your PDF will be saved on your computer and you can see uh, the output. This is the cv.pdf file. Now let's see the second option. So let's say for some reason you don't have the Word app, you don't have the official uh, license of Word on your operating system. What you can do, you can just go to your browser and search for office.com. So this office.com is the official website from Microsoft and when you create an account in office.com, you will be able to edit your PDF files on your browser using this office.com website. So just create a Microsoft account and then just uh, log into your office.com account. And once you have opened this office.com uh, website, you can see I have already logged in to my office.com account. I will just simply drag and drop this uh, DOCX file here, which is going to upload my uh, Word document into office.com and uh, once it's uploaded you will be able to see uh, that this document will be opened using this office.com website so for this office.com you don't need any word license or anything you don't need to pay anything it's a free uh, option which you can use and you just need to upload your word file here and then click on file and then click on save as and you have the option to download this file as PDF. So I'm going to just click on download as PDF and once it's converted to the PDF file, you can see it's downloaded directly. So you can just open this file and you can see it's converted to the PDF file. So this is the free option. You don't need to pay anything. You don't need to have the official word license, this office.com allows you to edit your Word files uh, online for free. Now let's see the third option. So let's say you don't want to create the Office account and you also don't have the official activation for your Word app on your operating system. The third option is also very simple. You just need to go to your favorite browser and then search for Word to PDF online and here you will see different website which allows you to convert your Word document into the PDF documents. So here in the result, I can see adobe.com allows this uh, service also. Adobe is the very big company, so I can trust this. I can just uh, click on the Adobe link here and then I can uh, just select my uh, document so i will just select the word document here and then click on open and it's going to be uploaded and also it will be converted so i will put this link in the description of this video also so you can directly go to the adobe website 
Now once this document is converted to the PDF file, you can just click on download, which is going to download your PDF file. You can see it's downloaded. You don't need to sign in with the Adobe account. It's optional. So if you want, you can create your Adobe account, but it's not necessary to convert this file to the PDF file. And I can open this file and it looks like this. Okay. So these are the three simple ways in which you can convert your Word document into the PDF files. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.